so tired of editing today. I'm gonna go get myself a snack, because I deserve it. I wonder what we have for food. Ah, mira nomás. We have frijoles. I mean, I'm not really craving frijoles right now. Let me see what I have in my pantry. Hey everyone, it's Yalil and welcome back to another spicy, amazing, and juicy YouTube video. Do I really need to introduce this? You already know what's going on in this channel. Well, if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for being here. But if you are new to this channel, you may not know that we are currently playing all the games on the Roblox game, Short Creepy Stories. We are now currently on story number four of the series. But if you wanna watch part one, part two, and part three, the links will be in the description below or they will be right here. But yeah, without further ado, let's get right into this game. You know the drill, guys, come on. You like, you over, like, if you're new to the channel, you may not know the drill, but if you're a returning viewer, you already know the drill. You're gonna turn your lights off and your sound up. Let's go. Today, my friends, we are going to be playing Night Shift on Route 90. Let's go ahead and read the story. This case occurred back in 1998 in a store outside the city when one employee first went on night duty instead of his colleague who disappeared. Task list, clean up the store. Not a problem. I wonder what happened to Nobu, he usually works at night. Okay, we got the mop. Go ahead and clean the store. We got a few spillings, not a problem. You got one over here. Yum, yum. We got a dookie stain in the bathroom. I feel like it's a recurring theme in these games that, you know, we just absolutely have a dookied up bathroom. Nobu has obviously gone crazy though. The manager asked him several times not to glue these things. It looks like some kind of Japanese amulet. I don't know for sure. Someone soiled the floor. All right, next up, take out the trash. Okie dokie. Let's get this, take this, and we can only take one at a time. Open this up. This is kind of spooky. Going outside at night to take out the trash always kind of scares me a little bit. What are those sounds? Oh my, that raccoon scared me. I was about to say like, it sounds like a raccoon or some type of animal. We don't have any tasks to do. So let's just like chill at the counter. Read this, let's read the note. Always check the cameras, keep the doors closed. Whoa, why did the radio suddenly get really loud? Okay, so we gotta keep this door closed. Can you turn this down? Let's go ahead and look at the cameras. All right, all right. Next camera. Oh, that's me. Hey, y'all. Good evening. Oh, man. Go back. Y'all saw that, right? Y'all saw that? Oh, man. Oh, a customer, a customer. Hello, sir. My name's Yaleel. I'll be your... Oh, okay. I guess I won't be of your service today. Yo, where'd the dude go? Hold on. I'm gonna ask him if he needs any help. Did you just wave your hand? Bro, you know you dookie the bathroom, too. You do not just walk past me. Hey. Hey, you want to step it up, sir? Let's help him out. I will only take this. Oh, only? Three freaking bottles? You owe me $17.03. 30 cents, sorry. I forgot my wallet. Can I pay later? TBH, guys, I don't get paid enough for this job, so... Okay, but be sure to pay later. Thank you, I won't forget it. He's probably gonna get really drunk and forget, but honestly, I don't get paid enough for this job, so I don't really, like, care, to be honest. Let's continue looking at these cameras. Nothing suspicious yet. Lay out the products. Okay, no problem, no problem. Let's Close that up. I have nothing to do. I will carry it one by one. Okay, let's put this over here. I know night shifts are like usually pretty scary, but like it's chill right now and that's all that kind of matters as long as we're safe in the meantime. Wait, oh my God, arcoiris. I used to eat those all the time when I was little. I didn't even realize what they were. Are we like in an OXO or something? Cause this is like, these are Hispanic products. I want to pretend that this is an OXO just cause I feel seen and identified right now. Dude, these slap, if you've never tried arcoiris before and you like marshmallows, these slap. That was disrespectful. I need a moment to recover from that. That was actually really brutal. So far out of all the games that I have played, that was the most disrespectful jump scare I have received. Oh, and these tricky trackies. Oh my God, dude, these slap. Every time I go to Mexico and we go to the Oxxo, I got to stock up. If I were to be on Ox at a gas station, I'd be playing Pink Pantheris, Doge Cat, Megan the Stallion, Flo Millie, Nicki Minaj, you know, all of the bangers of this generation. Can I help you? Hold on, let me put this away and see what this guy wants. Can I help you, sir? <laughs> you smell like spring. Why, thank you. I don't know if that was a compliment or not, or maybe he's just like mad, like mad to Lulu, like me. Let's see if somebody came into the bathroom while I was stocking up and absolutely dookied it. Just gotta make sure. Okay, bet. 
close that up. Hello, ma'am. That's a ma'am, right? Oh, I think that is. She looks like a Karen Loki with that haircut. Let's go up to her and check her out. What do you mean by that? Not like that. She's old. Do not touch me. Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. I, I did not mean to touch you. My sincerest apologies, ma'am. Is ma'am gonna buy something? Did she leave? Maybe she fell into the toilet and can't get up. Why is she looking at me like that? Did I do something? You good, ma'am? Is the Alzheimer's getting to you or something? Thank you for shopping at OXO. Are you just gonna stare at me like that? Why is everything so expensive? Just say that you're broke and leave. Sorry, but I don't set the prices. You're an idiot! Tell me why I've had that same interaction at my job too. All right, let's check these cameras. Something's going on that's like not sitting right with me. Is that? Oh, oh ma'am. Do you want to play with me? The garbage can is on fire and need to extinguish. Oh, let's get the extinguisher. Whoever set the trash can on fire, your mom's a hoe. Extinguish that bit. Let's go ahead and put this back. Check the cameras, check the cameras. I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh my god, oh my god. Night vision on, night vision on. <gasps> we gotta go bust them. Let's go, guys. Come on, we gotta confront whoever this robber is. Hey, man! <laughs> what the flip just happened? Okay, get the radio. An emergency power outage at 12.30 a.m. The night engineers of the Central Electric Group put into operation backup diesel power plants. It was reported that the power supply was interrupted. Check the cameras. Check the cameras, dude. Okay, nothing suspicious. I repeat, it's behind you. What is behind me? Check the freaking cameras. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. <gasps> oh. Can I? I can't check the cameras. <gasps> what was that? Hold my hand, guys. Hold my hand. Oh my hand, I'm scared. Who wants all of the smoke? I'm so ready to play. Oh, whoever's playing with me, you better not. Ah! What do I do, guys? Can I leave? I wanna leave. I just went through like the five stages of grief right now. Oh, the someone's pulling in. You good? I don't think he's good. I'm gonna follow him just in case he gets any ideas. What you want, bro? I'm fine? Right. I overdid it a little, but it's okay, I'll take more. You owe me 17.30 again. Yes, I remember. This time the wallet is with me. Take a hundred dollars and keep the change yourself. Good night. Oh, good night to you too, sir. Thank you. Are you are you sure you're good? That was looking kind of funny. Why is that door open? Who's back here? Oh, someone stole money. Dude, I think I was distracted by the guy and somebody freaking stole some money. Oh man, am I about to get fired, dude? Oh my God, this dude is back. Can you get the heck out, sir? Why are you wiggling like that? <laughs> I beg your finest, most exquisite pardon. Hello, sir. Welcome to OXO. What can I get for you today? You found what you were looking for? Yes, only this. Good. You owe me four fifty four for this. Here you go. Good night. Thank you, sir. Love you. I mean, what? I didn't mean to say that. I swear. No, boo. What the WTF? What is this? Open. Oh, I guess we gotta clean this. What is this? What the hell am I carrying, guys? Is that Nobu again? I could not. You could not what? Find me. Check the cameras. That's my... That's my... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Where'd this person come from? Oh, you scared me. What did you want? Today, a 3 a.m. a Chevrolet van was found, which flew off the road at high speed. Unfortunately, the driver did not survive. During the audit, it is found that the man who was driving was in a state of intoxication. I didn't have to drink so much and drive. When it's coming, you need to hide in the toilet and lure him there. Amulets will protect. Why are you covered in blood, sir? What? Who's coming? Okay, open this door just in case. What am I supposed to be luring? <gasps> what is that? Ho, 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 ho. Hello? Ah! What was it? It seems that Nobu's amulet scared the creature away. Nobu, you're a freaking real one for that one. Thank you. I don't know where you are or if you're even alive, but man, you just saved my life. Now we gotta clean up the store. Let's go ahead and clean this blood up. Clean this up, clean this up. Is there anywhere else that I need to clean? Let's check the bathroom in case the spirit do eat it. 
Okay, I don't think so. Well, my shift is over. I'll go home. Can I take some tricky trackies though? Like I, I, I want to go. I want to stock up on some. Hopefully, nothing jump scares me as I leave. You survived the night, although you allowed the theft of a large amount of money from the store. You were not fired. Ending two. I mean, it's not a terrible ending. I'm low key fine with that one, to be honest. Low key, that was so fun. What the heck? That one jump scare that like actually shook me to the core. That one was so good. I haven't had a jump scare like that from a horror game in a while, dude. None of the other games that we've played on Short Creepy Stories has done it like this one so far. Round of applause for that one. Round of applause. Let's do a little research and see how some people got ending number one or I guess what they would like to call a good ending. Oh, I see. Dude, why did that guy take off running like Naruto? There he goes again, running like Naruto. So yeah, the only difference was that you catch the thief and then you get ending number one. I feel like this was a solid, solid game. This was probably my number one favorite so far from all the ones that I've played. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you liked it, make sure to give it a big juicy thumbs up and subscribe for more great content like this. I will see you all in the next one. Adios.